Let's once again join Brad Jay and Kristen Garrett for the exciting conclusion of the Ultimate Border Championship. Here we are, Seaside Park, Ventura, California, stage three of Ultimate Border. It's all about skateboarding. Speaking of skateboarding, guy by the name of Andy McDonald, he is in the house here for skateboarding. Now Andy, of course, being an X Games champion, he also gives back to the kids. Check it out. It just happens that uh, the title sponsor this year is Coast Body Wash, and uh, they invited me up, and I, I really didn't know too much about the competition, but pretty neat thing they got going on, so. Glad to come up and support. We got a street course here. We got it, it's all to ourselves for the next hour. Let's just skate around and if you're working on something, maybe I can help you out with it. Maybe I'm working on something and you can help me out with it. Skateboarding has given me literally everything that I have in my life, so any chance I get to give back, I do. You know, meet with kids, tell them the story of my life, and oh yeah, by the way, I don't do drugs trying to get the message out of what a positive influence skateboarding can have on your life. At 35 years old, I still get uh, as much enjoyment out of it now as I did when I was 12. Final number two was stacked with two ultimate border veterans, Aaron Astorga and Chad Scheller, facing off with bowl skating legend Omar Hassan. Every time I skate, I try not to do too much or hold back. Just try to, you know, do as good as I can, and hopefully it's all about rolling the dice and staying on your board and having fun, so. Astorga didn't want to let Omar get off easy and was really feeling the new ramp. Chad Shetler was determined not to let his third place finish in the mountains go to waste. He put it all on the line, tearing up the whole ramp, skating doubles with the others, and attacking the judges' table. I'm not a judge, but to me it's looking like Chad, it's either you, Omar, or uh, Double A at this point. What do you think? It could be anybody's game. I mean, it's ramp super fun. We're all having a good time, so it's just we're gonna skate and do what we do, and whoever comes out on top, comes out on top. We're down to the final event, the overall Team Skate Challenge. With two stages down, Team Hasoy has a very commanding lead, and today it's up to team leader Christian Hasoy to bring home that win. It all starts right here, right now. Team skating was electric, as a mix of young and old went berserk on the ramp. So how cool is it being out here? I mean, it's not just you. I mean, you got Steve Caballero's in the mix, Christian Asoy out here, some of the true legends of skateboarding. That's got to be a treat. Yeah, it's really neat to see the different generations. I mean, you got the guys I grew up admiring, Stevie Cab, Christian Asoy, and then you got the young guns like Karen Caples out here, you know, 12, 13-year-olds just killing it. So it's neat to see the mix from both worlds. Louie, you are absolutely destroying it out there. Talk about your skating, bro. Uh, just trying to get as much tricks in as possible and just have fun with it. Crowd favorite Christian Asoy was unstoppable in the prelims and ready to seal the team title win. I'm here to do as best that I can. Hopefully I can at least pull us through with the number one spot. That's right, you gotta take it to the final and all eyes on Team Asoy. Yeah, no pressure, no <laughs> pressure on me whatsoever. <laughs> And so the final was set. Skate wizard Andy Mack taking on the legends Christian Asoy and Steve Cavallaro and the young guns Tyler Martin and Eddie Moreno. In a high energy final jam, young Eddie Moreno got creative on the mini. Tyler Martin attacked the vert section Steve Cavallaro fired up the crowd with hand plants and finger flips, and Christian Asoy went bigger and faster than anyone. But nobody could touch Andy Mack's tech tricks and his ability to work the whole ramp with creativity and style. Andy Mack's arsenal would seal the stage three win for Team Gritty. Christian Asoy grabbed second place, and Steve Cavallaro came in third. 
Christian's second place finish secured Team Asoy the first ever Ultimate Border Team title. Bjorn, he took care of business, took the win, and then Tom Curran knows what he does. TC comes out and just destroys things at C Street. So all you had to do is just get up there in the finals. Were you a little nervous? I was nervous, you know, but every time I get into a contest, I'm nervous, and I think that's what kind of helps you push you and your adrenaline, you know, drives you to do better than you normally do. And so I, I like, thrive for that. Well, give it up right here. Christian Asoy taking that big win. Team Asoy in the mix. Hey, I just want to say, you know what? My, my life's been changed for nine years, and uh, I've been sober. I know I went through some tough times, drugs for 10 years, but went to prison for five, but God's changed my life. Jesus has changed my life, me and Caballero, and he can change your life. If he could do it for me, he could do it for anybody in here. You want hope, you want love, you want joy, you want peace, you can only get it in Jesus Christ. God bless you, thank you so much. And finally, in an extremely tight points race, it was time to award $30,000 to the 2009 Solo Ultimate Border Champion. In a skate final that saw Omar Hassan rule the ramp and take first place, Chad Shetler outscored Aaron Astorga and Christian Philippe, giving him enough points to be crowned the 2009 Coast Body Wash Ultimate Border Champion. Well, here he is, Chad Scheller, the ultimate border. What does this title mean to you? Uh, so much. I mean, just the whole week has been so much fun, and it's a lot of work. And to come out on top is just, it's, I can't even describe it. It's so awesome. Well, that's it. All done. We saw snowboarding, we saw surfing, and we saw skateboarding. What an amazing week, Chris, and it's been. Absolutely, and I think congratulations are in order to Team Hosoy and Chat Shetler, your overall 2009 Ultimate Borders. I already can't wait for the next one. On behalf of Brad J, I'm Kristen Garrett. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next year.